so Sonic, what you're basically telling us is now says that Mario finally won a death battle. Are you serious? Sonic, please tell me this isn't true. To be honest, Tails, it is true. I lost and Mario won and I guess the Nintendo mascot still carries on his name, but I still feel the winner. Even if I lost, I still feel a winner, not a loser. That's a good way to think of it, Sonic. I'm proud of Mario. But you still feel ashamed, huh? Yup. And besides, they focused on the games, not the freaking comic books or the freaking Mario movie and even. Aw, oh, that sucks. Yeah, if they did focus on the freaking comics, then I could have won, but... Oh, uh, we focused on games, which Mara had more power instead of me. Are you serious right now? You made Sonic look bad, Sonic. It's not like I wanted to. I just couldn't force them to make Sonic win. It's just based on the games and the analysis. That's all. I still think it's your fault. Besides, they don't focus on you, boom. They actually focus on the real Sonic, not you. Okay, but we're still both Sonic, so we're both included. Huh. Yoshi, Yoshi! Yeah, Yoshi's right. It doesn't matter who wins or loses as long as they both had fun watching it. Me and Mario did have fun watching it. And it proves that Mario is good once in a while, but I have good things, he has good things, I have bad things, he has bad things. But uh, we're always going to be legendary. It's true. Do you think there's going to be, a, you know, a remake of me and versus Luigi? Maybe. We'll see. I hope so, because I won last time, and then Luigi probably wants a rematch. I really do. I want to prove Tails that I'm not more of a coward as he is. <sighs> uh, video games these days. Hey, me and Rex love video games. I don't. It just makes everything an addiction to video games. Uh, anyways, did you miss me while I was gone? Uh, yeah, I missed you. Awesome, did a Ham miss me? Why do you want to know? Just wondering. I mean, me and him are best buddies after all. I mean, yeah, he missed you. I mean, he keeps thinking that he's... Uh, people keep thinking he's gay because you're a girl and you're actually a guy. I mean, you look like a girl, but you uh, talk like a guy. So which one are you? Are you a mix of both? Because that would be awkward and weird. Oh, no, no, no. I'm definitely a guy. Oh, good. Tell the others that because they keep thinking Ham's gay. All right, let's just skip all that. Uh, what just happened? I'm not sure. Anyways, uh, all that aside, how's the others? I mean, have you seen Prickle Bands, Dolly, stuff like that? Stuff of our friends, our old buddies. Uh, no, it's just been me and Peas in the Pod. Peas in the Pod? Where are they? I don't know. They don't come out very often. I should go find them and give them a visit saying hi. All right, see you later, Trixie. See ya, Buttercup. Uh, he does walk like a girl. Anyways, let me go find Rex. Yeah, and I was playing, uh, you know, Sonic Colors, and Tails here act like an idiot in the game. Wait, what? Why can't you come on my journey with me instead of fixing and, you know, fixing a way to, you know, transport the wisp back? I don't know, Sonic. You, you're the hero. You're mostly in the game, so I don't have no reason to be in the game. Still, you could have helped me on my journey. I'm with Mario all times. Oh, are you trying to rub in my face now, Luigi? The uh, no, but I'm just saying that me and Mario are bros, and you guys are like bros, but you guys have to be together. It's weird that a hedgehog and a fox are together. Why is that weird, Sonic? Because I'm a, I'm like a prey, and you're the predator. You're a fox, and I'm a hedgehog. Oh, yeah. You guys didn't realize that before? Uh, no, no. You see, we're different, I guess, because, so uh, you know, I'm just... I'm just different and Tails different. That's something we have in common, but we never would hurt someone. And Tails wouldn't hurt a fly. Really, he wouldn't. I'm as sweet as a daisy. Yeah, 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 whatever, Tails. Hey, Sonic! Yes, T-Rex, that name's escaping me. I have to tell you something. Yes, T-Rex. My name is Rex, by the way. Oh, I forgot. I'm sorry. I'm not really good at names. 
If it's my name, that's easy to remember because I'm older, famous, popular, and handsome. Oh, whatever, Sonic. But anyways, can I ask you two something? Sure. What is it? Well, uh, me and Mario were talking about Sonic 06. You know, that horrible video game. Oh. And, you know, we were talking about who, th who thought of that game. Like, who created it and who invented it. And... Well, and Mario was talking, and I told Mario who, th who thought of that game in the first place. What did he say? He was thinking you might have created it. Wait, wh what? Yeah, he thought you created it since you're a Sonic, you, you know, you're Sonic after all, and you invent all the games, right? No, I'm just the character. The creators invented it, not me. You know, the game creators. Oh. Uh, what? Why and how would Mario come up with such a thing like that? Mario, did you th thought I was creating the game? No. Mario, I didn't even thought of the game in the first place. I'm just a character who goes in the game. Oh, really? I didn't know. Mario, did you know? No. How could you think Sonic created the game? He didn't even want that game to be created. I told him it was a stupid idea to create a game like that. Really? What did you say to them? I want to know. Okay, people, sit down. I'll tell you the story of what I told the creators. All right, story time. Eh. Uh, this is this is as close as I can do to sit. Uh, this is fun to hear, so I guess I'll listen to. Oh, this is going to be good. All right, Sonic, take it away. What did you say to them? <sighs> okay. So when I heard about what the game's gonna be about and stuff, about me saving a princess and stuff like that, a human princess, I thought that was pretty stupid because I'm a hedgehog and uh, she's a human. I told me it was a stupid idea to create something like that. And for me getting kissed at the end of the game with her. And, well they told me if I rather be in the game or not be in the game at all. And I was like, <laughs> Uh, you can't have a Sonic game without Sonic. I'm just saying. Give them more information, Sonic! Okay. And I said if the game ever got creative, I'll think of idea to run off away from the princess and never see her again. See her ugly face again. That's what I said. Sonic, tell them how, how the way you'll react if she kissed you. So you see when the, um, you know, that scene where I kiss her at the end of the game? Well, I was almost gonna literally throw up during the game. Like seriously, literally almost throw up. But you didn't. Did you like the kiss? Ugh, no, no, not at all. I was gonna throw up in the game. And then I'll run off, like run away afterwards. That's what the game was gonna be about mostly. Yep, me throwing up when I kiss, you know, when I get kissed by the princess, I'll run off and never see her ugly face again. Huh. Well, you, you know, Sonic, getting, you know, saving a princess isn't bad. Look what I do with Peach. Uh, that's your... <laughs> that's your thing, Mario, not mine. I don't save princesses. I save my friends from Dr. Eggman. That's my... That's my thing. Not, you know, not, I'm not into your thing very much. Saving princesses is not my thing. Princess Elise is not that good of a character. I'm just saying. So the creator thought of that game, not you? Heck no! Why would I think of a game like that? <laughs> yeah, I'd rather save Amy than a princess human. Speaking of Amy, tell them what you'd rather replace the princess for. <sighs> Alright, I said what about we just switch Princess Elise with Amy instead. You know, getting, you know, getting say, you know, saving Amy instead of the princess. I'm just saying because I just can't, I just can't bear. Wait, 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 how about the part you got killed in the game? That was something. Oh, the part I got killed? That's how the creators reacted. You know, they thought about killing me off since I made that stupid advice to them. That's just how it works, I guess. But since I'm the main character and I'm the star, I should give them the advice. The, you know, the ways how to work the game. Uh, you know, some tips, some stuff, because I'm a video game character. They're not video game characters. I am. I make the great games. What good games did you ta talk to with the creators? 
Uh, Sonic Colors, that was one game I told them about. See what the game was going to be about. Saving, you know, the Wisps and stuff like that. And there was other Sonic games. Sonic, uh, Sonic Unleashed, that was a game I thought of. Because I love being, uh, I love being the, uh, Werehog. It's my, I, I don't think I have it in me anymore. I think I do. But, you know, the moon's out already. And every time there's a full moon and the moon's out, that means I turn into the Werehog. But I'm not into the Werehog at the moment. I don't think it's still in me. Actually, yeah, Sonic, it's true. You don't have the werehog form. How do you know? Because I gave you some kind of serum to, you know, take away your werehog form. I still have it. I just gotta inject you with it again. Oh, well, I guess I can't have it. Ugh. So, that's basically the whole point. You didn't want that game to be made in the first place. See, I knew the real Sonic couldn't think of a game like that. No, and Mario, I don't think <laughs> Rex would ever fall for something like that. Of course he do, it's Rex! Hey! Sorry, no offense. But yeah, I think Princess Elise is a horrible character and I never want to see her freaking face again. That's, that's basically the whole point. Well, thanks for telling us that story, Sonic. No problem, and lesson learned. Don't ever fall in love with a freaking human if you're an animal. That's my lesson here. Cause I'm not even a human, Elise is a human, but... I still had to do what the creators told me to do, and I told- I swear to god I gave them advice how to fix the game perfectly right, but they didn't listen to me. It wasn't just Sonic, but it was me as well, I gave them advice. Besides, Tails wasn't mainly in the game, I'd rather have Tails than Elise with me. Well no crap, he's been with you since the beginning. It's true. Well, thanks for the info, Sonic. Ugh, now I know what happened to the game and why it's created. Yeah, well, you're welcome, and I don't ever want to make a stupid game like that again. Yeah, and also people hated Sonic Forces. What's up with that game? What are you talking about? Sonic Forces is a great game. Oh, well that's probably, that's probably me just talking. Heh, <laughs> bye. Sonic Forces was a great game, right? Yeah, it was an awesome game. Oh, okay, so I guess it was just him talking. Sonic, I have one more game I want to ask you about. Ugh, what? I'm tired of talking about games. How about Sonic Free Riders? Sonic, okay, that game was just a pain. I, I'm just gonna let that out right now. I mean, I didn't even create the game, the creators did. Oh, well, it had Jet in it. Jet's a freaking show off. I'm not gonna lie, he is. He literally is. He thinks he's faster than me, but I'm actually the faster one. So. What is your thoughts on Sonic Free Riders? <sighs> Sonic Free Riders is just a stupid game and it's really irritating to uh, players. Besides, a lot of people don't like that game either. Hmm, I guess I'm the one who has all the good games. Hey, Mario! Are you serious? That's why you want to tell me this whole subject? What? It's true! I have all the good games! Oh, I'm gonna freaking speed over to him and slap his mustache off. All right, all right. Calm down, deep breath, Sonic. <sighs> all right, I'm fine, I'm cool, Tails. All right, but it's cool you told them about your info of the games. Yeah, there's still a lot of games that are garbage. Some of them, a lot of them actually are good, but some of them is mostly what the creators have done, not me. <sighs> so, Jack, it's almost Halloween. Are you gonna plan to do something spooky this year? I, I'm not sure. You're not thinking about taking over Christmas, right? Oh, heavens no. I, I'm not thinking about doing that again. I learned my lesson. But Halloween, I'm not sure. I don't know if I have my scare anymore. I'm pretty sure you still do. It's inside you somewhere. I haven't celebrated Halloween since, well, last year. Yeah, that was last year. That was a year ago. It wasn't that long. Oh. Well, me and Zero will think of something, right, Zero? Woo! Woo! That's awesome, me and Jesse will be looking forward to it, and I guess all our friends too. Yeah, I never get scared. Really? Yeah. Me, Woody, and Bullseye never get scared. I didn't know about that. Yeah, Westerns always stay brave on their owns. Oh. Uh, I guess me and Zero should go and think about something on Halloween. Come on, Zero, let's go. Alright, think of something good! Oh, I don't remember the last time the gang got scared. <laughs> Me either. Uh, oh, I feel so relaxed.
Uh, what is it, Jessalyn? Or is that Clone Slinky? I can't tell the difference. Hi, Woody. Oh, uh, never mind. It's Jessalyn. Ugh. Ugh. What is it, Jessalyn? I just want to get next to you and hug you and feel your biceps. Uh, <laughs> I don't have biceps. I'm, I'm nothing but a freaking noodle. Uh, to me, you're more bulky than Buzz. Really? I mean, <clears throat> no, I'm not. No, I'm not. I'm, I gotta go. But Woody, bye, Jessalyn. <sighs> Someday I'll get Woody. Someday. <sighs> hey, what's up with Clone Woody? It's bad armor, Woody, to be exact, but I don't know what's wrong with him. Oh, hey, Woody's over there. We should ask him what's up with him. Oh, Jessalyn going on my nerves so bad. Oh, hey, guys. Hey, Woody. Hey, what's up? Oh, nothing. It's just Jessalyn's getting on my nerves. Hey, Woody, I have a quick question to ask you. Yeah. What's up with bad armor, Woody? He keeps looking at Jessalyn like in a weird look. Bad armor, Woody? I don't know. I haven't I haven't seen him in a while. Is he okay? I'm not sure, but I think I know what's up with him. He's hitting puberty. What? No. He needs new batteries. What? No. Guys, are you blind? He's in love with Jessalyn. That's all the way. Wait, what? That's impossible. Why would Bad Armor Woody love Jessalyn? Well, Jessalyn just doesn't know Bad Armor Woody as much as the regular Woody. He's still Woody, it's just with battle gear. Really? So, Bad Armor Woody loves Jessalyn. Well, he can have her. I don't need her. Yeah, well, it's not that easy. Jessalyn just can't, just thinks Bad Armor Woody's like freaking invisible. Bad Armor Woody hasn't even talked to her that much. Well, Bad Armor Woody keeps trying. It's just that Jessalyn always interrupts him. About him. About me. Ugh. Well, we should talk to him about it. Uh, yeah, we should. Come on. Coming. I'm coming too. Ugh. Hey, Bad Armor Woody. Hi. Oh, hi, friends. What's up, Bad Armor Woody? Oh, Woody, where did you come from? I went on the other way around. Oh, well, uh, nothing. Nothing's up, guys. Why? Why are you asking so many questions? We only asked one question. Yeah, what are you up to? Nothing. Nothing, guys. I'm just looking at Jessalyn. Okay, okay, but we have another question to ask you. <laughs> what do you mean? We have another question to ask you. Okay, uh, what's the question? Do you love Jessalyn? What? No, 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 no. I don't love Jessalyn. What are you guys, crazy? I'm a bad armor, uh, you know, toy. I don't love people. Really? Hmm. That makes us feel suspicious. Tell us what you know about Jessalyn. You gotta admit it. Uh, 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 fine. All right. Yes, I have a crush on Jessalyn. Really? Well, finally we have someone to love Jessalyn. Yeah, Jessalyn's always around Woody's back, like every few seconds. Yes. P -p 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 please, Bad Armor Woody. Please try to admit to Jessalyn that you love her. What? Are you crazy? I can't do that. Why not? Because he always, she always loves the real Woody. I'm not the real Woody. I'm just a bad armor Woody. It doesn't matter. Yes, it does matter. You're still Woody. You're just with battle gear. She wouldn't take me. Yes, she would if you just tell her. Guys, I'm not having this conversation. All right, bye. Uh, bad armor Woody. Oh, a bunch of freaks. Uh, someday he will learn how to love with someone else. He's just too shy to ask her. Yeah, well, he's hiding right now. We should just give him some space for now. But for now, I'm gonna ask Buzz if he can watch something with me. Alright, see you later. Yeah, see ya. 
Oh, it's a lovely evening. Yeah, we haven't hanged out with each other for a long time. It's true. Hey, Buzz. Uh, till a sheriff comes into my way. Oh, great. Yeah, Woody? You wanna watch Super Mario Logan with me? Why? Because I'm bored and I don't know what to do. <sighs> fine, 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 fine. I'll react to with you. Besides, it's been a while since we reacted with each other. Oh, actually, that's true. All right, I'll react. All right, come on. Uh, uh, see you later, Jesse. Uh, so much for hanging out with each other. See you later, boys. All right, Black Yoshi's Call of Duty loan. Uh, no, 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 no. Another Black Ops has been out released? How many Black freaking Call of Duty Black Ops has been released? Oh yeah, you know Black Yoshi too well apparently. Is it a toy? Is it Woody? Is it Shrek? It no, it's Black Yoshi, how figured. Blue Coops? What kind of language is he speaking? I don't know. Okay. Why would you do that? You live in the same house. 74. It didn't. Yeah, it wasn't enough. Okay. Whatever. <laughs> oh, you're gonna ship him, are you? Oh, you are. You should have done that long ago. Jesus! You are a cop, after all. Antarctica? Is there a person in there? No, just ship it to Antarctica and have a nice day. Oh, that wine makes me feel bad for Black Yoshi right now. Well, did you do the right thing or the wrong thing, Mark? Oh my god, the box is right there. <laughs> Should have gave him a sweater or something. <laughs> He's waddling like a penguin. That's hilarious. It's a penguin. It's a bunch of penguins. Oh my god. Oh, what the heck? It's not Black Yoshi, is it? It's a, it's, there's no way he can get back here in one night. There's no way. Uh, wow. Did Black Yoshi tell you to do something like that? Oh my god. Black oops. I can't get over that freaking word. I'm gonna say that. Black oops. Of course, the map packs. Whatever. The way he said that, a chicken and a sweater. I can't get over that. <laughs> You're just doing everything Black Yoshi did. Are you gonna get Wi-Fi? Cause there's no way you can get Wi-Fi. It's Black Yoshi. I wonder what this could be. It's Black. Oh, and Brooklyn T guy. Wow. Ugh. Don't want to eat a cheesy gordita crunch wrap right before Wha you pack Why? Why would you pack yourself up after that? You nasty. Why did you say it like that? You nasty. You nasty. <laughs> what? Why? Why would you give him money? Well, I had to be stuck with him in a box for a week with him bitching about Call of Duty. Oh, that's understandable. But you can force yourself not to give him that money. Well, it was that, and I also felt kind of guilty about the whole ancestors and slavery thing. What? you go bringing it up again. Your ancestors? That is, that is a just an excuse. On the underground choo-choo train for me to have to hear that. Inflatable two man did what? Inflatable two what? 
Tooth Man? That is not a name. You give your money to him. Yeah, I, I'm kind of wanting it back now. Oh, wow. Hey, are you just mad because you ain't investing my college duties. Like, if you, how is it investing anything? If I buy you the new Call of Duty that they make every year. For the return on investors. See, what had happened is, when you buy the game from GameStop, and you play it for a little bit, you get to take it back and they give you money. That's returnist on investors. When you, uh, when you take the game to GameStop, they give you like 18 cents for it. Exactly. Returnist on investors. Why? No. No. Yeah, that's two hundred bucks you just lost. I think he's good for it, right? Absolutely. Let me go get the game Wait, what? No. He's not gonna pay you back. He always says that. Shit. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I'll be back here next week for the money, just in case, okay? He's not. He's not gonna give you the money. He never gives people money. One week later. Force night? What? Ma'am, are you know I ain't owe nobody no money. Yes, you do. Yeah. Fart box man. Call him that. That's hilarious. You were gonna pay me back once your welfare check came in. Where's my money? Oh yeah, yeah. See what happened was. Yeah. Yes, it did, Black. Your welfare check came in like a few days ago. Ma'am, are you always snitching? Okay, so where's my money? See, I already spent it all. What, you, you spent it all? Already? Oh, pirate cookies. But pirate cookies. cookies? Yeah, let me show you. Chips Ahoy! Ahoy! Ahoy oh, man. wow. Pirate oh, my God, I get so it. Ahoy, matey. Yep. On Chips Ahoy pirate cookies? That's, yeah, that's, that's, that's yeah. yeah. They're not really called pirate Santa cookies, but you could call that, time. that, yeah, and I, I guess. I give him some cookies and milks. And then, I was just chilling by the lake, and then Cookie Monster came up. Cookie Monster? There's no way. Cookie Monster uh, doesn't even exist. What's wrong with you? What happened to the money now? I, I, I just really need my money, okay? There's no know. way Cookie yeah, Monster could show up. Cookie. Your name is Cookie Monster. Wow, this happened. Cookie. Yeah, so Cookie, Cookie Monster, Monster does show up in here. Mm. Yeah, Cookie Monster now, uh, exists. Yep, confirmed. Cookie no Monster is real. <laughs> Whatever. Cookie, I like cookies. Oh, yeah, and how do you afford those cookies? We know you like cookies. Yeah. You You're Cookie problem. Monster. We can either do this the easy way, or we can do this the hard way. Oh, hard way. Cookies. You want cookies? Yeah. Nice cookies. Yeah. With the chocolate chips. Yeah, yummy. Yeah. Cookies. What? Uh oh. He's going to smash it. You you like cookies, we know. Okay, well then how about you tell me where my two hundred dollars is, Mr. Cookie? I not know anything about money. I only like cookie. That's too bad. Oh just smashed it. Yeah, where is his money? Tell him before he kills you. He's gonna kill the cookies and kill you next. That's what's gonna happen. Oh my god, Cookie Monster is dead! No more Cookie Monster! You're messed up. That is Cookie Monster's head. You better give him that money! Never mess with Brooklyn T guy when you never give him money. That's a lesson learned right here. Never ever mess with Brooklyn T guy. Man, I never see Brooklyn T guy like this at all. Wow. It's the the Oh my god. The cords. All oh, you just Oh my god. What what the Oh, whatever. He didn't talk, and you saw what happened to him. You're next. Yep. I ain't got your money, folks. That's too bad. I guess I'm just gonna have to sell your Ooh. Xbox. He's bribing you. You better give him that money. Oh, no. You're not gonna ask him for the Xbox, are you? A new one? Really, Black Yoshi? 
dollars, so he's probably just trying to get his money back. He's gonna sell your stuff now. But fuck, he can't do that. That's my Xbox. It it is your Xbox, but you never gave him money. You gotta learn your lesson that you can't just take money from people and not pay them back. Yeah. Always pay the people back if you know the person gave you money. Always pay them back somehow. Oh wow. Oh, you got that 200 bucks from the Xbox? Finally. I'm a doctor. I just taped his head back on. What? Oh wow. You couldn't have stitched his head on, but you taped it. That's gonna that's gonna fall off somehow. Whatever. Where is Black Yoshi? You oh my god <laughs> what's your favorite video game um some mario games uh some sonic games what's your favorite buzz um there are the toy story wii games there's also pokemon video games i like yeah that's basically all my games but yeah, that, this was a really funny video. It had a great um, plot with Black Yoshi. I enjoyed it. Um, I think this is one of my favorites. I think a, a lower 5 to 10, you know, like a top 10 list. I think I would put this on the, you know, the lower, mm, a little bit between the 8 and the 7. I think I'll give it, yeah, I think I'll give it, put it on like a 7 top list. I don't know. I think I'll put it on the top 10 list. That's all I'm going to say. Yeah. But I did enjoy it. Black Yoshi was hilarious. Brooklyn Guy was hilarious. Mario was just in there. I mean, uh, Mario wasn't. Mm, I mean, he, he it's Super Mario Logan, so of course Mario has to be in there. But um, you know, he he was just there. But Brooklyn Ta uh, Brooklyn T Guy and Black Yoshi were hilarious. I enjoyed every single minute of it. And yeah. So guys, ow! I hit my head. Ow! Are you okay, Woody? Yeah, I'm fine. Anyways, redo. Anyways, guys, that's the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I did really enjoy the Super Mario Logan uh, movie. It was really great. Uh, great focus with Black Yoshi. Next is Woody. Hear that, Super Mario Logan? It's Woody next, okay? <sighs> better. Yeah, I'm better. Anyways, uh, we'll see you guys later in the uh, next video of a Toy Story show, which is going to be the Halloween special since Halloween's during the school week, and I can't film during a school week. So, anyways, yeah, so this is WayFan360 signing off. Goodbye, and we'll see you guys later. Take care, partners. Bye, Space Rangers.